I'm Sarah Hashimaris for Smart Trend News, and this is your Midday Market Recap for Tuesday, June 1st, 2010. The major U.S. equity indices are trading mixed Tuesday despite positive reports on construction spending and manufacturing, which signal that the economy is continuing to recover. The Commerce Department said that construction spending rose by 2.7 percent in April, the largest since August of 2000. Economists had expected spending to be flat. The Institute for Supply Management's manufacturing gauge fell to 59.7 from 60.4 in April, better than economists' expectations of a fall to 59. The euro slid as low as $1.21 today, its lowest level since April of 2006, but has since climbed higher. In corporate news, BP shares are trading 12.46% lower at $37.60 after the company reported that its top kill tactic to stop the oil spill in the Gulf of Mexico had failed. AIG shares are trading 1.47% lower at $34.86 after the company's board rejected Prudential's bid for its AIA unit after Prudential cut its initial $35.5 billion offer by about $5 billion. Prudential shares are trading 7.94% higher at $16.85. Hewlett Packard shares are trading 0.26% higher at $46.13 after the company said it would cut about 9,000 jobs and record $1 billion in charges in the next several years as it creates fully automated commercial data centers, which is expected to save the company about $700 million annually. Taking a look at where the markets stand midday, the Dow Jones Industrial Average is trading 0.37% higher at 10,174. The S&P 500 is trading 0.13 percent lower at 1,088. And the Nasdaq Composite is trading just barely higher at 2,257. I'm Sarah Hachimaris for Smart Trend News. For more news and market analysis throughout the day, visit our website, tradethetrend.com, or subscribe to our YouTube channel, Trade the Trend.